This is the Osprey Pixel Backpack from uh, Osprey. And this has been my daily driver for about the past six months, and I actually really love it. It's a nice backpack. And I'll tell you why. I love it. But first, physical overview. The front. As you can see, it is a very unassuming backpack, and I love backpacks that are very clean, very tidy, and do not stand out too much, other than my bright orange rain cover. As you can see, we have, oh, oh, we have a loose zipper. Get it up. We have two water bottle pockets, one here and one this side. I wish they were a little deeper because you can see this is, I don't know, a 20 ounce water bottle. I wish it would go up to like here just to keep it in a little bit more. It keeps it in there, it keeps it in there, but it's, uh, yeah. Although it's very clean, very unassuming. Just to kind of give you an idea of, of what it looks like on the back. So I am about 5'8", 135 pounds. This is how it looks. Getting into this compartment, you just gotta be a little bit rough. There's a little reflector, reflective material, reflective stripe here, and a little place to like clip on a bike light, which is nice. So to get into there, you just gotta kinda be rough with it and just kinda rip it open. Inside they have their, what do they call it? Their uh, powerhouse cord organizer, which is just a nice little bag with some zippers and some individual places for different cables. I just have a extra battery for my T430, Lenovo laptop, ThinkPad, and then also a 170 watt power, power adapter for my P52, Lenovo. So nice, compact, easy place. And then to get it back in, you just shove it in there and you just gotta be a little rough with it, just, you know, The front too doesn't help, but you get used to it. Once you open this flap up, you get access to all of the insides of the laptop. And one thing to note right away is once the flap is open, it, it stays out of the way, which is really nice. It just kind of stays there and you have full access to everything on the inside. Also comes with a nice handy handle up here, so you don't have to flap the flip Flip the flap, flip the flap back to get at the handle to pick it up and carry it somewhere else. You can just grab it here and carry it to across the room. Pocket on the front right here. A lot of organization. Put your pens and doodads and keys. And I usually have a power bank in here. Oh, what's in there? As you can see, this is a black and green bag. I wish they had different color combinations because I really like black and orange. So I wish they had black and orange or black and purple would be cool. But the green is nice because it's very easy to see inside the back. Bam, look at that. So I have my 15.6 inch P52 laptop right here. I have a 14 inch T430 laptop right here and then two fairly large textbooks. So you can fit a lot of stuff in here and it, it's, you know, it's compact. It's a little bit, on, you know, on the wide side, but as you can see from when I had it on my back, it, it doesn't like protrude out from your back or anything. It's, it's nice and compact. And the nice thing is it has these like little expansion like gussets so if you wanted to add more room to it, so you know that's that's how much room you got in there. You can unzip it. Oh, look at that! You could fit a whole another like two textbooks in there, or like I don't know, definitely would fit in there. So it'd be like two and a half laptops then. So let's just take out this stuff so I can kind of give you a tour. So I got my two textbooks. I got power adapter for the T430. So plenty of room. Look at all that room right there. Laptop one. And we'll keep laptop two in there for just a second, but just, just to show you. I think these are just more for like papers and like magazines and stuff, your, your business documents, but they're large enough you can fit laptops in them. So if you want to do that, you totally can. We'll do the good old classic uh, bazooka style so you can see inside the bag. Boom. So nice deep. That right there is the bottom or the top of that.